Saturn is probably the most recognizable planet in our solar system. With large bright rings encircling it, it is the sixth planet from the Sun and the second largest gas giant, about twice as far from the Sun as its nearest neighbor, Jupiter. Saturn is an intriguing planet with its size, its wide rings, and its diversity of moons. While all of the gas giant planets have ring systems, Saturn's is by far the most prominent. Once thought to be a solid structure, the rings of Saturn are actually composed of billions of small objects. The size of the particles varies greatly, from tiny clumps of ice to boulders larger than an automobile. Since the rings are a collection of individual objects, each particle, clump, or boulder is following its own gravitationally bound orbit around Saturn. Now, the large-scale structure of the rings we see has been divided into seven ring groups with various gaps observed between them. There are three prominent rings, A, B, and C. And there's four fainter rings, D, E, F, and G. The rings were given these letter designations in the order of their discovery. As a matter of the dark gap seen between A and B, it's named the Cassini Division after its discoverer. It measures 2,920 miles wide, which is just about wide enough for the planet Mercury to orbit inside that gap. So you can see just how enormous Saturn's ring system is. Its full width extends approximately 350,000 miles across. Yet this massive collection of billions of particles spanning hundreds of thousands of miles across is so balanced by the laws of gravity that its thickness is less than half a mile. This razor-thin geometry, at least on the scale of Saturn, induces a seeming optical illusion every 15 years or so when Saturn's rings disappear. This is known as a ring plane crossing, and the ring orientation becomes edge-on so that you are looking exactly along the ring's plane. Through history, the times of Saturn's ring plane crossing from Earth's vantage point have been periods of great discovery. You see, with the beautiful and stunningly bright rings out of view, Saturn's system of moons can be probed with greater effectiveness. Prior to the era of satellite missions, numerous of Saturn's moons were found during these periods. And Saturn has lots of moons, in the neighborhood of over 60. Of these moons, Titan is the largest, and it's the second largest moon in the entire solar system, larger than the planet Mercury. Interestingly, Titan is the only known moon in our whole solar system to have a dense atmosphere. Even though it is large and has been observed for a very long time, very little was known about this moon. That is, until the Cassini satellite arrived in its orbit in 2004. It began its long mission orbiting around Saturn, and one of Cassini's primary missions was to study the moon Titan. The satellite released a separate probe named the Huygens probe, which entered into the atmosphere of Titan and descended to the surface. This probe gave astronomers a way to study the amazing features of Titan. And Titan turned out to be an extreme world, where its surface has been shaped by rivers and lakes of liquid ethane and methane. Saturn is an excellent example of the magnificent beauty and order in the cosmos. As one of the most recognizable planets in the solar system, Saturn and its ordered system of rings and moons reflects the design given by the great designer. Everything God created is meant to reflect His glory, and Saturn is no exception. As it says in Psalm 66, Come and see the works of God.